Hello, it is Kitty Blue. Um, I am going to do a box opening today. Uh, this box is from Doll Family. Um, or this doll is from Doll Family. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. Um, it is December the 2nd. I'm just going to move the camera down so you can see the box opening. And I'm pretty sure this is my doll family. <laughs> um, I've never ordered from doll family before, so this is going to be a new style of a doll for me. As soon as I can get this open. what we've got here. Got some kind of postcard. How cute, a little Merry Christmas card. I don't think it says anything on it. Nope, it's just a little card. Okay. So, um, huh. So this says Island Doll. So maybe it's an island doll. I thought it was. I thought it was doll family. <gasps> I'm mistaking. I don't remember what dolls I actually have ordered. So, um, but yeah, this is um, island doll. There's a wig in here. <laughs> Zero's little snoot down here. Zero dog. He has to look at everything in my videos. Don't you, buddy? So yeah, this is some type of a silver gray wig. I'm guessing that was just given to me for free because I don't remember ordering a wig. Alright. So, um, this is going to be there's eyes. And so this um, doll is, it says 47 centimeters, which is this cool. It's got this little card that gives all the measurements on it. Um, and this is the doll. Camera's not pre-focusing, so sorry about that. And uh, this, I'm guessing, is maybe a certificate. Yep. So, um, the doll is called Uncle Doll, and it looks like it's in a normal um, resin color. There wasn't any option to choose the color, so that's just what it came in. I'm not sure what their normal resin color looks like. And like I said, that piece of paper did say 47 centimeters and he does look quite tall. Wow. Holy moly. He is quite tall. Definitely smells like resin. <laughs> Got that fresh resin smell. Oh, this is a really nice body. Um, the normal color is, um, it is almost more of a yellowish color. This is my other doggy, Oryx. He decided to come and visit. Hi, buddy. Oh, this is so cool. Oh my gosh. This is really, really awesome. So this is his head. He is so cool. 
Um, head cap seems to be might be this string here. There we go. All right. Yeah, I got the head cap down. The string was like in the middle of it. So yeah, he's like blush. So like the whole back of him is like blushed and the front is blush. So it's kind of like a Boston Terrier um, ish looking like face up and everything and blushing. But oh my God, this is like amazing. So, um, okay, I'm just going to do a quick body review then for this Island doll. So he's got double jointed legs. Having problems getting this other, there we go, kneecap here. There we go. So the double joints and the knees look really, really nice. Um, he could like kneel. So he's got double joints in the arms as well. So he can like basically fold his arm all the way up. Sorry, I'm going to pull this up here. There we go. So he can touch his face. His cute little doggy face. Oh my gosh, this is so, so freaking awesome. Had I been good at blushing, I probably maybe would have gotten the head blank and um, blushed it differently, but yeah, that's this is fine by me. Um, there are some like marks here on his neck. Um, I'll get that, hit that with like a magic eraser and see see what that's about. Um, it could just be from the blushing on his head. Um, so he's got a two-part torso. I'm not sure how. Whoa! I guess he can swivel this way, swivel that way, pops, and slouches. So yeah, wow, this is like, the body's very solid. Um, I really like it. So here's his hands. So it's his movement of the hands. Not so, not too bad. Uh, let's look at his head here. So that's down. That's back. There's always like an issue with like dolls being able to look up. It's usually about as far as most of them go. And then you can go to the side, and the side, oh my gosh, the head tilt. <laughs> okay, this this guy is just so amazing. I'm really, really, really happy with this. Um, oh no, except for, he's got a little chip in his leg, I just noticed. There is a little tiny chip right here on his ankle. That kind of sucks, but... Um, I'll send a message to them. Maybe they'll be able to just replace the uh, the calf piece. Um, his feet seem pretty slim in comparison to his body. And uh, I'm gonna have to pop his pop his eyes in. But oh my God, this is just fantastic. This is just amazing. I really, really love him. He is just really, really cute. I'm not sure what I'm going to name him. Um, now I feel like I'm going to have to do another body comparison video um, with the Island doll. Um, it'll be interesting to see whether or not this skin color matches like Resin Soul's white when it's yellowed um, because that's it looks like a very yellowed color. I know the normal the normal pink that Resin Soul has is definitely not going to match this color. Um, I have a certain idea in mind for another character through Resin Soul that's going to be a dog as well, or you know, they're the little dogs that they have. But um, yeah, this is pretty cool. Love the body. Love it, love it, love it. So again, this is the Island Doll. Um, it's called Uncle Dog. And um, he is 47 centimeters tall. So um, that is it for now. I do actually have, uh, I just got notification that my um, Doll Chateau order is in and it has been shipped. So I should probably get that maybe next week because um, I got the notification for this one, I think, um, a week before 
my doll chateau which I'm kind of surprised well I guess not really I, I think I ordered in July and it's now December so um, they're a little bit more ahead of schedule than usual normally I have to like wait like over six months to get doll chateau but I still do not have my doll leaves order that was the first order that I placed and it has not come in yet so um, I heard that the wait on that is about five or six months now too so that should be arriving soon. So thank you again for watching and um, see you next time. Bye.